I made some chicken and rice soup. And boy, is it good. Mmm. 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 This is homemade, not out of a can. Gotta love a slow cooker. Alright, so let me tell you about the day I had today. I bought this phone on the 24th of September from T-Mobile. And I was hunting for a phone. And the reason why I chose this one was because, number one, I liked LG phones. I researched it and I liked what I saw. And number two, they had a good deal because I was told with this phone, I get a free tablet. I was like, yeah, free tablet. That's what I want to get. So, I went ahead and got it, and I had been patiently waiting for my tablet to come. You know, today, me and Daniel went to the mall to go to T-Mobile because I wanted to find out what the status was with my uh, tablet. I found out today that apparently I was supposed to answer some kind of email regarding the phone. The person who sold me the phone never told me this. Here's the guy's name right here. Jose Cosme, C-O-S-M-E. He was the guy who sold me the phone. Great guy at the time. I mean, he helped me out, got it going. Never said a word about me having to respond to an email. So, I told the guy at the store, I never got an email. I even, didn't even get an email about it. He said, well, you should have got an email. So I pulled out my phone and checked my emails and showed him there was no email in here. And I said, well, wait a minute. And I opened up my spam folder. Bam! There it was. An email saying I was supposed to respond to the uh, offer of getting the free tablet. The offer of which is now expired. So, the guy in the store, he told me to, uh, this one right here, that's the one I went to, Concord Mills Mall. Oh, he told me to call T-Mobile and see if they couldn't do something. So I called, did the 611 on my phone and called T-Mobile, sat on the phone with a representative and then two supervisors for probably over an hour in the mall trying to get it straightened out. Bottom line, I'm screwed. Um, for some reason, there's no tablet I can get now because the offer had expired. And as I told the last supervisor I, I spoke to, whose name I can't remember, I did record it all. I'm not going to play it for you here because I'm not sure that's completely legal, even though they recorded my calls. I told him I was recording his too, and he got kind of pissed off about it. He said that my only recourse is to, they'd sell me the tablet at $100 off. And I said, that's not the deal I signed up for. I signed up for a free tablet. And he said, well, then the only other thing I can do is to return the phone, because I was just, this is today was the last day of the 14 day grace period that they give you a T-Mobile. If you don't like it, you can return it. He said, I can return the phone, buy it back, and get the new offer they have of when you buy a T-Mobile phone, you get an LG tablet. What the frig difference does it make? Ends up, that's what I try to do. I go back to that, to this LG store here, right here, this one here, Concord Mills Mall. And the guy in there was great. He was trying to help, do everything he could to help me. It was the people on the phone that was giving me the runaround. And, um, and in fact, I said to the guy on the phone, I said, well, look, I understand this offer isn't available now, but it was off it was available when I bought the phone. I don't understand why is it I can't get this tablet that I didn't know I was supposed to jump through hoops to get. Why wouldn't you just send it to me anyway? And he gave me some lame excuse I can't remember because I could barely hear what he was saying. And uh, so I go back to the T-Mobile store, this one here, right here, Concord Mills Mall, and uh, we're getting ready to do the exchange. And then he sees. That I had bought a pre-owned certified LG V10. And he says, oh, I don't know if we have any of those. He runs in the back and checks and lo and behold, they have none. He calls the next closest store. They don't have any either. So he said, well, I can buy the, a new LG V10 at $500. I told him, 
If I wanted to spend $500 on a phone, I would have bought the new one from the beginning. I bought the used pre-certified phone for $350 because it was $350, not $500. He told me my only recourse now is to run around Charlotte, call all the T-Mobile stores in Charlotte, and see if, I, if any one of them had a pre-owned certified LG V10. Basically, I've been screwed out of the tablet. When I got back, I received a text from T-Mobile. T-Mobile free message. A two-minute survey is on its way. How did we do when you called on October 8th? Here's the question. How likely are you to recommend T-Mobile to a friend? Really? On a scale between 0 and 10, where 0 equals not at all likely, and 10 is extremely likely. Zero! T-Mobile sucks. Oh, I got another question. How satisfied are you with the T-Mobile representative you spoke to on a scale between 0, 1 and 10, where 0 is not at all satisfied, and 10 is extremely satisfied? <laughs> zero! He didn't do crap for me except give me the runaround. And you can't tell me there's not an LG tablet laying around they can send me when I had this offer. More questions. How easy was it for you to resolve your issue on a scale between 0 and 10, where 0 is not at all easy, and 10 extremely easy? <laughs> 0! Like I said, I was getting the runaround. That was it. There did... No questions. How satisfied are you with the ability of the reps to fix your issue on a scale between 0 to 10? <laughs> 0! They didn't fix squat! They tried to sell me another tablet, sell me a tablet that I was supposed to get free. Please provide any additional feedback about your experience. I'll be glad to. T-Mobile is crap! Exclamation point. You offer a free tablet and then do not deliver! Exclamation point. Your in-store representatives need to explain all the hoops that your customers have to jump through to get your so-called free offers, exclamation point. I was on the phone with a rep and two supervisors for over an hour today and didn't resolve squat, exclamation point. I know that I am not going to re-up with T-Mobile and I'm going to make sure everyone I know knows not to use T-Mobile because T-Mobile is selling a bunch of crap, exclamation point. Send. There we go. I got a T-Mobile phone, paying more than a little more than I had originally intended to pay for a phone, but I was fine with it. Thank you for your feedback. But I was fine with paying a little bit more because I thought I was getting a free tablet. I'm not getting a free tablet. They screwed me out of a free tablet. Nothing I can do about it now, except make this video and rant and rave. And let everyone out there know that if you go through T-Mobile and they offer you free stuff, beware. Make sure you know exactly every little hoop you have to jump through, every little thing you have to do to appease the T-Mobile gods so they will give you your so-called free stuff. Because it's all a ruse to get you in there and buy their service. I was using AT&T for about a year and a half. I was happy with AT&T. The only reason why I didn't go with AT&T when I changed my phone is they didn't really have the phone that I was looking for. T-Mobile did. This LG V10, which I researched. I liked everything about it. That's why I got T-Mobile. And it was the thing that really set me over the, the line about deciding whether I wanted to go and get this phone from T-Mobile and go someplace else was the free tablet. I have no free tablet. I don't care about the service anymore. I wanted this end it and go somewhere else, else and get it but uh i don't know i gotta read my contract see if i can get out of this stupid thing um this phone how much i've been paying for all together because this is a bunch of crap and i hate being lied to and i hate being given to run around and i hate t-mobile so there you go but i love my soup oh this is so good if you deal with t-mobile you're prepared for a lot of bullshit because that's about all you have is a lot of bullshit See you next time.